description and it explains more. It has more description. It tells what type of dog it is. It tells what kind of dog it is. Okay. What did, do you notice any something that I did not include yes. in this last hole? You didn't include stuff. I didn't include stuff, but what's something that we like to put in our writing that I did not include, Zaya? You don't know? An amazing fact. An amazing fact. Do we? Do amazing facts in our personal narratives? No. Dialogue? I didn't put any dialogue. What about L-Y words? Did yeah. you see any L-Y Absolutely. words in here? No. Fluffy. No, I, there could be more fluff. Who said that? Somebody said that. That's good. There could be more fluff. It's good, but there could still be more fluff. Right? Yes. All right. So, did you notice that I didn't just say the dog? Yes. What raise your hand? What are some things that I said besides putting just the dog? K nine. K nine. Uh, brown and white German Shepherd. Brown and white white German Shepherd. Well, that was yes, talking about her tail. But when you're doing your writing, you don't want to keep saying, I went to the store. Then I went to play soccer. Then I went to school. You don't want to keep putting I because your reader's going to say, will she please stop putting the word I and say something else, right? So if you, if you saw the dog, the dog did this, the dog did that, the dog did this, the dog did that, would you be bored? Yes. Yes. yes, even if there's a lot of fluff, I think I would still be bored if I saw the dog, the dog, the dog, all the time in this, okay? So make sure that you're using different words to describe what you're talking about. Um, all right, so our activity today, you are going to um, create a paragraph that fluffs up a small sentence. What I like this one, I like the dog, she is fun. Okay, so you're going to get with a partner. You and your partner are going to come up here, and you're going to pull a who, a did what, a when, and a where. Once you and your partner has your little papers, you're going to create a basic sentence. Okay, a basic sentence similar to this one, I like the dog, but whatever your paper says, okay? After you create your basic sen sentence, you need to elaborate on it. Describe what the who is or where where it is. Describe what it's like in the where. Okay, you need to elaborate your sentence. Do you notice that I only have who, the what, where, and when? What are what am I missing? How. How, how and what else? Why. 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 So what does that tell you? If I don't have a how here or a why here, what does that tell you? Why you Raise your hand. you want us to make it ourselves. Right. You need to come up with the why, and you need to come up with the how. That's part of you elaborating, okay? So we're going to do this quick example. My, I have a dog who went to playground in Alaska. <laughs> random so some of them might be silly but that's what makes it fun and it should be a lot easier for you to elaborate when it's kind of silly. Alright so I have a dog <laughs> Playground. 